did it, Mom. You've been avenged. Look out! Colette! Lloyd, are you okay? Yeah, but you're... I'm fine, really. You bastard! Kratos, you pathetic, inferior being! Feel the pain of those inferior beings as you burn in hell. Colette, that wound. Colette, hang on! Colette, your wound! Thanks for worrying about me, but I'm really okay. For some reason, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> Strange, huh? You certainly are not okay. Rain, you can use healing arts, right? Yes, but... Colette, I can't keep it a secret any longer. Everyone, listen to what I have to say. Colette can no longer feel anything. What? What do you mean? Colette is growing closer to becoming an angel. Now she can't sleep, or feel hot or cold, or pain or anything. She can't even cry. Becoming an angel means losing her humanity. Lloyd, it's okay. I'm okay. So... Right now, we need to do something about this ranch. Right, Lloyd? Yeah, but what should we do? We should destroy it. This facility should be equipped with a self-destruct mechanism. Well, that's kind of extreme. But I suppose it is the best idea. Lord Kavar, thanks to you, the Mana Cannon will soon be complete. Oh, do not worry, for I shall carry on the Angelus project. Oh, I suppose you can't hear me anymore. <laughs> well then, I take it that you won't mind me taking the research data from the Angelus project. Let's go back to town first. We can talk about what to do next after that. Lewin is in shambles right now. Are you sure Colette will be able to rest there? Perhaps Asgard would be a better choice. Yes, I think that's a good idea. Lloyd, I trust that's fine with you? Yeah. I'm sorry, everyone.